Hey hens, how are we all diddly doing? How's everybody holding up? So in my review, I said that confidence, like child confidence is one of the things that I found quite half-baked. And I thought, let's take that idea and just take it to the extreme and have two children, one child, whose confidence I try to build up. One child whose confidence I absolutely try and ruin. Obviously, very obviously, do not do this in real life. It's very important in real life to always build up children's confidence. It's a really important thing, but obviously we are in The Sims. So these are my test subject. We have, appropriately named, bad child, good child. I don't need to explain who's going to be which one. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's there. You can put the pieces together. And then we have this. And she's called Mother of Sims because she is Mother of Sims. It's Mother's Day tomorrow in the UK. Don't be freaking out in case you're not in the UK and it's not Mother's Day for you. It's not supposed to be. I, I did move them to a house and then I started recording and now I'm like, ah, shit. I didn't actually give them any bed. So let me just put a little, uh, uh, boop, 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 boop. So that's the bedroom. But I also made it completely fair. I mean, it doesn't really matter what traits she's got, but she's a slob, loyal, green fiend, and muser. And then good child is a cat lover. Bad child is a cat lover. I'm going to turn aging off and we'll just give it from Sunday to Sunday. So we'll play it a week. And also the, they don't have any likes or dislikes because I wanted to, to keep it like 100% the same. And in terms of the, the relationship with the mother, they don't have any family dynamics, basically. So I wanted to, oh my God, that is literally a booty and a half. I wish I had that booty. I do not have a booty. Um, I am flat. Sometimes people say to me, can I make you in the same as I'm like, yes, under one condition, you give me a booty. I actually don't know if I'm that flat. I just know that one time in university, someone said to me, wow, you really do have a flat ass and I've just stuck to it. And then that kind of stuff keeps me up at night because then I'm also like, shit, what stuff have I said to other people that has like made a lasting impact, you know what I mean? I don't know if I've still got a flat ass. No, there's anything wrong with that. Moving on, right? Let's play the fucking video, Jessica. Basically, good child is going to have all of the love and care in the world. Good child is going to work really hard at school, might even help her in school. And then bad child, uh, she's only going to go to school to leave school. You are looking way too happy about your situation, you absolute adulterer. I don't know if she's actually going to adulterer because there's no one to oh, be adulted. You know what? I really fucking feel that actually. And you two can stop looking so happy. So good child, I'm going to have you just have a great relationship with your mother. Just sit and talk and stuff like that. And you are just going to be a complete little dick. Make a mess. We don't have any confidence at the minute. Uh, there we go. Neutral confidence. And what have you got? You've also got neutral confidence. Well, do you know what? I'm going to express admiration for you, darling. Family kiss. Share a secret. Just really, you know, be the absolute top parent to you. Jokes is not. I don't think he jokes is actually. I, I really don't believe that either of you are that funny. You can't be happy and funny, babe. It's one or the other. Do you know what I mean? One or the other. And then with you, I'm going to yell up for making a mess. How dare they? You little shit. And I'm going to criticise the lack of the creative growth. I do feel quite mean when I'm doing this, but I do also find it quite fun. Just know I wouldn't act like this in real life. And I'm going to shout forbidden words. <laughs> and you know what? You are so deserving of that look on your face, child. Like, honestly, you have been, the, our kids are set up to fail and you very much are. And I'm going to praise your effort in social growth. I wonder who's going to reach it first. Who's going to reach? Why do you have low confidence and you have neutral? I've been nothing but nice to you, good child. Honestly, you don't know a good thing if it slaps you in the fucking face. I literally praised you and they're losing confidence. You're feeling confident, but you've got low confidence make it make sense see this is like a part of a reason where i'm like do you like complaints no how have you still got neutral confidence i mean at least yours is back up to neutral confidence yours makes sense to be neutral yours absolutely does not babe i would be broken if i was in your shoes mock outfit oh this is a child <gasps> i'm gonna make them favorites you are my favorite fuck this child in particular throw a tantrum yeah i would say you have a difficult family dynamic darling i want to see if that has an impact on the confidence as well because it should not be neutral although do you know what it might take time but the thing is it takes so much time to go bad but then like after one thing it's positive again they have high confidence that you know what that checks out i'm gonna make you do your homework as well and you are i'm gonna hide your homework from you actually i'm gonna put it there and i'm gonna build a box around it i am literally setting this child up to fail god bless their absolute cotton socks you know what i'm not gonna let you use the toilet that may be an absolute dick of me if i look for a specific sim does that mean that i can still go here no okay you're gonna piss yourself babe and you're not gonna be happy about it but you know what it's literally all for the cause. Building skills is also a way to get your confidence up as a child. So once you're done with that, you are going to go build your more skill. You know what? I might even complete your thingy and see if we can make an impact on it. And you are absolutely not allowed to do anything of the sort. You just honestly relax, babe, because you've got fuck all to do. And we'll focus on you. Oh, there is a child. We need to meet a 
a sim stay away from fucking crumple bottom though honestly actually <gasps> i might have you come here and rude introduction an unstoppable object meets an immovable force okay we completed that one achieve level five social skill and make a best friend forever well i think the mom's gonna be the best friend forever honestly okay but first go piss girl go piss girl why can't you piss am i gonna have to make a separate bathroom just so that one of the children can wee it is looking likely guys it is looking likely oh you pissed yourself come on your confidence must be low it's still fucking new bro we've literally just pissed ourselves in front of agnes crumple bottom the worst possible person to piss yourself in front of but somehow they managed managing to feel confident make it make sense because it's not computing for me i am gonna let them eat though i'm li i'm not gonna starve a child i'm gonna make them work on their social skills so we can complete this part of it i'm not gonna have this one just why have you just got your confidence up from yelling at your mom shove criticize lack of social growth oh my god it's literally 12 a.m all right we can continue working on our sleep and deception tomorrow oh the fucking monster under the bed what the fuck is happening excuse the shit out of me an earthquake since when the fuck of earthquake quakes been in game what the fuck i wish we died <laughs> like i know that might be a little bit grim but i do wish we died i wish we had like a option to die that's fun that's interesting is that new i've literally never had that happen before i do enjoy that that's quite fun you were gonna miss school actually you're not gonna go to grade school you were gonna go to school and study hard actually just just for the sake of it it, it really convenient in me I'm just going to fill everybody's needs. Honestly, she's fucking flat out. I don't know why she's not waking up, but honestly, I don't blame the kid either because I wouldn't be waking up in this situation. You could say I'm a little bitter. I would be too. I really can't fault you, babe. Oh my God, there's a literally another earthquake. What the fuck? I do think that should come into milestones. I do think that it should be a milestone to have an earthquake. Are we on a fault line or something? Quake zone. It's city living. Apologies, guys. I'm going to shove and provoke. We have low confidence now, which is great. And you have... A science project. Oh, you're sad. To be fair, that was me, darling. That was me. I'm going to make you start working carefully on that. Can you go and help assist with project? There you go. Okay, their confidence is going up. They have high confidence now. You have low. Can't blame you. Nice. Start chemical reaction. Okay, I'm going to have you be a bitch to your man for a little bit. I do feel like, you know, if we're shoving our kid, I feel like... <gasps> No, don't. You are my favourite. No, you go sit in your bedroom. Become best friends. Nice. We're supposed to become best friends with three other children. Okay, that may be a little bit difficult. Oh my God, they're away. I'm going to have to get the Defender light. I'm really just going to have to do it. It's honestly, it's really boring my piss. I'll see you in the morning. Bad accidentally went to school. I'm going to make bad skip school. There's still a high school C student, which is interesting. I just don't feel like that's 100% correct. Yes, answer the principal. Let them know. I will let them eat though. I am. I am good in in in, in that regard. Have a ham and cheese sandwich, Delling. And then I'm just going to have a be a bitch to a mam all day. We're still low confidence on Tuesday. It's Tuesday. We're still low confidence. And you have high confidence, which is a really good. G, G's all round to you, babe. Okay. I played through a day. Oh, shit, shit, shit. No, bad. You do. You are. You definitely should skip school, actually. Yes. We are grade C. We still haven't managed to get anything lower than a C so far. But hopefully once the principal calls, it goes down a little bit more. No. It does not. In fact, it absolutely does not. But I mean, good's doing all right. To be fair, I haven't really made them do homework or anything apart from that one day. In fact, I did actually forget. And now I'm just, this is the first time I've remembered actually. So that's not very good. But it is Wednesday. They have low confidence. They have neutral confidence. Babe, I'm literally doing fucking everything to try and make you happy. Jesus, honestly, good is really actually quite selfish. Just not a good thing if it would slap her. And that's not the first time I'm saying this about this video. Good is a little bit of a shit, to be honest. You've literally got friends, right? This poor fucking bad as shit themselves more times than I can count, which is really rude if you're actually ins. I mean, at least they're doing all right at school. And we also mastered the social skill, which was nice. G fucking G to you. This child is absolutely suffering. She hasn't been allowed a bath or anything of the sort. I might actually unlock the bathroom soon because her confidence is quite low. It's staying quite low. But also, would that ruin the experiment? Like, I don't really know, babe. I'm not really equipped with uh, the science things. But good did kind of make a friend yesterday, N Nanami. I might even have a slumber party tonight to try and get like the friendships up with them yes invite over nanami we're friends we're friends with one other child slumber party good child so we've got three kids and the house shall be just this one babe what is little hat looks like an old man in a nice way we are now friends with them now focus on this one yes you are honestly you are the last puzzle in this piece oh we have high confidence again g fucking j are we nearly friends p.s it's literally it is oh my god copy is a total liquor <gasps> No, come on, PSP, my friend. It is actually 12 p.m., so I may potentially just get everybody to sell the sleeping bags, please. Time for bed. Okay, well, it's Thursday. Bad's got low confidence, which is great, and good's got high confidence. Once again, absolutely great. I am going to fill the needs of the world. I'm not bothered if it's cheating. You know what? This kid's fucking knocked out like fuck. I'm going to send a playful text. 
and chat. Oh, they're sleeping. Okay. I'm just gonna, <laughs> you will have my text, Pierce. Let's go and have some fun. I really agree, actually. All right, Pierce, we have 35 minutes for you to become my friend. Okay, we did it. We are officially friends with Pierce. Now, all we need to do is make friends with two adults. You leave school early. You need to actually go to school ASAP, actually. <gasps> We're a day. Lovely. That's what I like to hear. I was going to make this one actually tidy up, but I don't think I will. I think I'll make you clean up. Thank you. Grids it down. Bad's been doing poorly in school. She's not grade school D student. Oh, that's such a shame. Works out perfectly for me, though. I'm going to yell at. You know what? I might even nag you. You know what, child? I think I'm even going to shove you. Oh, they're both very angry. I love to see it. As long as you still got low confidence, babe. That's all I am bothered about. So I think off camera, I'm going to make sure that good goes out and becomes friends with two adults. Actually, you need to do the homework first because we need to age you up. I will meet you once that's done. Maybe I might even go for Agnes. Although Agnes is a bit of a tough cookie at crack. Maybe not. I may be cheating a little bit, but I've asked Clyde to stay over, which is a little bit weird. Like if your child is asking for adults to stay over, that's a, it's a, that's a bit... A little bit odd, you know, but I feel like it's it's the best I can do right now. We've got to make friends. We've got to get this fucking aspiration up. Yeah, okay, we like ambitionless sims. Jesus, Clyde, that is an insult. Are we friends yet? Yeah, we're friends. So to be honest, Clyde, you can leave. Do we know any other adults? I feel like I'm just going to have to find an adult on the street and just fucking become friends. Hello? Why is there absolutely zero adults out prowling in the streets? Oh, no. You leave school. Skip school. As for you, you can continue. Just be shit. It's the last day of school as well before they grow up. So I'm going to set their reputation to atrocious. <laughs> God bless them. Literally, they did not ask for this in the slightest. And I'm just haunting their every move. But I just want to make sure they've got as low confidence as they can, you know? It's my duty to the school. Right. I'm going to fill, fill the needs of the household because we need to go out and look for an adult. You might be a mail carrier, babe, but you are worthy for the job. Who is that? Oh my god, Nanami. Okay, I'm going to have her try and become best friends with him uh, as fast as we can. I'm going to really try, guys. Okay, we did it. We completed the aspiration. We're, okay, we're now socially gifted, which is great. But we did it. And I don't think that there's going to be much difference between now and Sunday. So I might have the man make a cake for the birthday. A coconut cake. Oh, fun. Coconut moment. There is a, a fucking plate in there somewhere and I absolutely know there is. But do, do I want to get it out? No. Add birthday candles. And you blow out candles. Go to send a bonus tray. Interesting. You know what? I'm just going to close my eyes and click. Okay. Yep. That'll do. What's our bonus tray been? High self-esteem. These sims regularly become confident even when they even when failing to gain skills or succeed at work. Nice. They're also less likely to develop a fear of failure. Add birthday candles and you can grow up. We've also earned a, a trait. Oh my God, that is. These sims become tense when they fail to gain skills or don't succeed in their career. They are also at high risk of developing a fear of failure. So, I mean, we grew up and we're, we are already tense. <laughs> I love it. I love to see it. It's the duality of man, you know, the duality. Well, that was fun. Didn't uncover much, really. What I expected to happen did in fact happen. Good to know, guys. <laughs> it's good to no, but I had fun nonetheless. I don't, I wouldn't necessarily say I had to work hard for it. I don't know, because it's not the type of any typical gameplay. You're not going to sit and like have your sim skip school and stuff. So this is with all of my impacts impacting it. I think I might also do a video of not interacting with the children at all and just naturally seeing where they go. So this is it when I'm like really trying to impact it. So the next one, not necessarily the next upload, but that I will also do a video where I really don't interact with them that much. I don't interact with the children. We'll just see where they go. That could be fun. We know what it's like now with lots of effort. Let's see with Don. G fucking G's, guys. And we'll give them the same traits, everything. Okay, that's the end of this video. I love you all so, so much. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, bitch.